Hello guys, the DB Grinder here, back at it again with another video, and this time I got the Flaming Storm with 690 rating versus Red Gamer 7 with 972 rating, so it's going to be another high rated DB video, and let's hop right in. We're going to have Red Gamer win the Rock, Paper, Scissors shoot, so he's going to get to the side, goes first, 40 versus 40, gotta love to see it. Opening hands, Conquistador, Wakero, Cosmic, Cursed, Red Eyes Fusion, no hand traps, but his deck's probably just not playing any. Gotta love the Moki Moki sleeves, by the way. And then Marionetter, Judgment, Imperm, Strike, Spoofing. Still on Imperm. Um, it's a really bad hand trap. Well, not like super. It's decent versus like Drytron. Like use it on Union Carrier. But it's like an FTK if you have this plus Faker. Normal summon, effect, set protocol. This is probably not the right zone to summon it in. I mean, he has spoofing, the dodge relinquished effect. Uh, I think it's worth playing around Geo and relinquished to, uh, like, even if, like, you're Hextia, because this is the Hextia zone. But I don't think it's worth summoning right here, right now. With Drytron being like the best deck and Relinquish being a thing. It's gonna set five pass. Ooh, draws pot agreed. Activate, banish six. Um, doesn't hit anything. Is playing Nova in the extra deck. Might come up with the opponents on Dogmatica stuff. It's gonna judgment that. And then Red Eyes Fusion. It's going to bring out Dragoon, plays around Geo, got to love to see it. Affect the pop, he's going to chain spoofing, shuffle back. Yeah, you just cosmic this for sure. It's like a very solid like trade right there. And then you still have Dragoon negate for something else. And you can still get one of these to grave, like walk hero to grave with Lord. And then battle phase, poke with Dragoon, only at 1,000 life points already. Main phase 2, activate cursed, pay 8, feel great, add Lord. And then Lord effects, send strike, Wakero, set Scarlet, pass turn. He could have also used Lord effect to like, send the ad back if he wanted to and then he'd have dragoon effect discarding lord and then he could have set conquistador so he'd have conquistador and dragoon draws faker he's gonna activate proto faker hand effect dragoon negate that uh, on field effect you won't be able to negate yeah he's gonna admit defeat and now uh, moving on to game two we're gonna see guys go first again Opening hand is Wyvern, Judgment, Wakero, Conquistador, Cursed. Opens these three again. And then Melusi, Cosmic, Silk, Anti-Spell, Cosmic. Well, this is an interesting game. He's going to Normal, make Link Karibo. He's going to get the Search Faker. And then set two pass. Ooh, draws the ultimate wizard in terms of attack and defense. Like, why? Why is it always this one? It's like, oh, it's, uh, I, I always say that whenever I draw. It's like, why is it always this one? I just hate drawing them so much. And I hate drawing this card, too. Well, I never really drew, drew this card. Because I never really liked the, uh, Insight Engine. Just adding more bricks to the engine. Uh, he's gonna Anti-Spell on Standby and then drop Faker. It's his only trap. And then Faker Effect, bring out Melusik. Normal Summon Red Eyes, Beat Over Link Karibo Effect. And then he's going to set some back row, pass turn, draws Extravagance under Anti Spell. Goes for Hextia. Judgment the Summon, Melusik to add Marionetta. And then Normal Summon Marionetta Effect. Set Manifestation, and then Marionetta, tag out in the Melusik, and we're just going to see the Flaming Storm admit defeat here. He knows that the Eldest Engine 
just cannot beat the Geist engine once, once the Geist engine is set up. Uh, Konkiri plus, like, Hextia is just too much. And then, like, Protocol being able to negate, add some. It, it, it would just, it'd be game for sure over time. Opening hand is Strike, Scarlet, Fusion, Ice Dragon's Prison, Strike. Whoa. This hand's nice. He has, like, that. And then, just traps that are nice going first or second versus this deck. This is really nice. Then he has Melusi, Konkiri, Faker, Manifestation, Proto. And we did see that he chose to go second. He's going to normal summon Melusik, go for Link Rebo, Melusik to add Marionetta. And then set two back row, pass turn, draws the Wyvern again. He's going to activate Fusion. That's going to summon out Dragoon by dumping two. And then effect the pop link Karibo, battle phase, attack for 3000. And then he's going to set four back row pass, end phase, manifestation, try bringing back Melusik. Oh, this is a rough one. So if you negate manifestation, then he has to activate another trap to be able to faker. You could also just negate faker hand effect and just let Melusik go through. But you also have Ice Dragon's Prison, so you want there to be a Spellcaster in Grave. Yeah, this is, this is tough. So, does he negate? Yeah, he's going to dra Dragoon negate. Chain Protocol. So that way his cards can't be negated. Bring out Melusik. Drop Faker. Faker effect. And then, yeah, it obviously resolves. Like, none of these can be activated. Bring out Silk. Silk effect. It's going to bounce Faker and bounce Strike. And then pass turn, draws Melusik. seek so many Geist monsters, holy. Uh, Silk Effect, bounce Proto and Scarlet, he lets it go through. And then go for Hextia, he's going to negate the summon, then Melusik seek Silk Effect, add Marionetta, and then add back Manifestation. I wonder how many Altergeist traps he's playing. He's going to summon and affect the set, so he's playing more than just two. Dragoon negate, and then set two, pass turn, Scarlet, set Wakero. Discarding the Eldish cards off Dragoon feels so good. Draw Scarlet. That's not bad here. It's a good discard. Battle phase, you're going to activate Manifestation. You definitely let that one resolve. Well, well you're not going to Dragoon negate that, at least. He's going to target out Melusik. And then drop Faker. Faker effect, bring out Silk. And then attack over Melusik. Konkiri effect. He's going to chain Ice Dragon's Prison on Silk. Chain Silk Effect. Bounce Faker and Wakero. Oh, that's like, that's so good. That get that that's two. It's two Silk right there. That's nice. Yeah. Konkiri bring itself out. Dragoon pop the board. Holy Melly Seek Effect. That's gonna add Marionetta. And then set two pat drop droplet droplet. I mean I guess the deck needs an out to Dragoon. Yeah, I, I mean I guess it's fair. I don't know. Interesting. Uh it's gonna normal summon Marionetta effect and then chain strike. Activate Protocol, Faker and Hand Effect, you Dragoon negate that, and then Chain Droplets, getting rid of Melusik to negate Dragoon. Faker, bring out Melusik, and then Link in the Hextia, oh, and, well, that's, this is going to be rough. He has no Silk left either, in before he just plays three. Add Faker, I hope he doesn't play three. 
And then he's going to attack in the Dragoon. Hextia adds Manifestations. So he's playing multiple Manifestations. And then set one, end phase, Scarlet. That's going to bring out Lord. Draw Scarlet? Why? Why does this always happen on my channel? Everyone always just draws Scarlet after Scarlet. Attack for 25. Or they draw Cursed off the Evil Twin. It's just... It's just normal. Or like DDR, Summon and Defense. It just happens every time. Manifestation, bring back Hextia, and then drop Faker, chain Scarlet and Grave Effect to set Conquistador. And then... It's going to set... It's 3 Meliaseek, 3 Marionetter, Conquiry, 2 Silk. Yeah. That's actually just his entire engine. So he has one Faker in deck. And then Red Eyes. It's going to summon back out Dragoon. Pass turn, draws Droplet. That... Like, how does he always be drawing Droplet like that? Like, that's such a good draw here. Normal summon effect. Sets Proto. So he plays two and two, I think. Marionetter. Give it a protocol. Bring out Meluseek. Switch to attack. Battle phase. Attack direct with Meluseek. Conquistador. Chain Hextia. And then that attack's gonna go through. Effect... That's going to send Scarlet. And then... He's thinking here. He's thinking about maybe going for a droplet play, I believe. Um, bring out Link Karibo. Meluseek, add Faker. And then Link off. Oh, okay. So that can just send Dragoon. Effect, send, send, manifestation, banish, add back protocol. A lot of people don't know this card has that effect. Really good effect. And then goes in the access code, gain 3000 attack, pop lord. That's going to set proto, set droplet, pass. If he doesn't have anything for faker, then... Could it have been right to Manifestation, add back Manifestation? I mean, I don't know what this really does. I mean, it could get you to this, which isn't crazy. You can put this on board, which is nice. Um, he's going to Scarlet, set Conquistador, draws Extravagance, Holy, draws Cosmic, Red Eyes Fusion... Yeah, see, there's the Nova. But the Red Eyes Fusion's already dead. Set it on the set. He's gonna Proto, bring out Faker. So what he has in the... Oh, okay, so he can negate Lord. That's not bad, that's not bad. You wanted to keep Axos Code alive. Which I guess is... Better than, like, bringing back Meluseek, which doesn't do anything. His engine is just completely dead. Lord Effect, and then Chain Cosmic, bring itself out, and then has Conquistador, oh my, and that's just game. Draws a Spell Slash Trap off of Extravagance, plus Cosmic, may have been his only way to win that game. And he just ripped it, like, his Extravagance draws were so good, this was a good draw, his draws off of it were good. Yeah, GG. Wow, that was an insane game. That was like, that, how long was that? Because that was really nice. 15 minutes? Yeah, that, it felt like it. It, it was nice. I liked that game. Uh, there was a lot of Geist. I posted a Geist video. Well, I recorded two today. This is the second one, but I posted one yesterday, and you're going to see this video tomorrow now. Um... I, thought, I think this is a really good video. I think you guys are going to like this. 
there was a lot of like luck like droplets off the top that was crazy but that's gonna be it for the video like comment and subscribe the db grinders signing off peace have a nice day